Yeah, it's Francis Martin. Francis! Yeah, we doing monumental things, man. Right now, I'm just, just getting my record produced by Johnny Juice. see what we doing right here we working with legends right now today man we doing a lot of big things man i'm here with johnny juice he producing my record right now we doing a wonderful things right now man it's like i'm on like a new world war, new world order you know holding the flag for lebanon strong island it's like it's like we got a lot of legends in the game from long island you know chuck d you know and it's like I feel grateful to be around their presence, you know, and um, have the torch passed down to a, a young MC as myself, you know. You know, you gotta have the right production and the right orchestration and the right curriculum to make this work. Francis Johnny Juice. Looking for Frank in the coffee shop. These snitches talk a lot at Billy Barber shop. Frank has human, half broke by. Plus a pipe pop. My boy shooting cops from the rooftop. That's on my dead pops. Don't walk up a down and dead end block. Get your jewels sucking. Hips that baby Brooklyn. NBC Brooklyn. Informing blood cushion. Red Cross in Haiti. How many lives took it? Grab my medication. Book of Revelations. Earthquake and Dungeon. Young generation, this ain't animation, it's too much temptation. Peer pressure, follow Lucifer Satan. I'm one of a kind, God creation. Like David in the lion's den, deep meditation. Frank practice what you preach, faith and patience. Faith and chasing recession, inflation. Sweet my own basement, inside mail and incarceration. This is real life, up north kites. Take a snitch life, cut the dark trite. We in the rotten apple. Francis Martin, aka a bunch of names. You got names like what? Nitty, Frank Nitty, all types of things, right? What made you change your name to just say Francis Martin? Just go back to the to the, the regular government. Really, what made me change my name is that when you think of Nitty or Frank Nitty, you know, 
you think of a mobster and a lot of things, then you got DJ Frank Nitty. So I didn't want to be portrayed as a as a mobster, as a gangster, even though, you know, I done bust my gun in it and not to glorify all that violence, you know. I just I just I was in search of myself and it took me a while and it's like, yo, damn, it just like a light bulb came off, like God was talking to me and was like, yo. Why don't you use your government, yo, Francis Martin? And I just thought, I'm like, yo, Francis Martin, that's just like me in a nutshell. And it's like, even on my future projects, that one of my albums gonna be named Francis Martin. So it was like really a blessing, because throughout my whole time grinding in, in, in music over 10 years, you know, I went from Nitty, Nick, Frankie Fingers, and it, it's just a blessing and I came like, yo, let me go with my government, Francis Martin. And it's just like the autobiography of Francis Martin setting up motion pictures, you know, just real life story. You know, I got a book, you know, it ain't published, but I got a lot of things that's just relating to Francis Martin, the government, Frank Martin. Grew up um, where exactly in Long Island? I grew up on 100 Terrace Avenue, the El Dorados, the 100 Block, you know, home of Lebanon, you know. In Hempstead, you know, exit 19 North, you know, you know, it's like I'm a product of my environment. I'm, I'm you know, I'm blessed that it, I went through the trials and tribulations because it brings a lot of brilliant stories out of me. Right, so I, I mean, I'm very familiar with that. People don't know Hempstead. A lot of uh, classic artists came out of Hempstead that don't necessarily rep Hempstead. Like Method Man and and and, and, and Prodigy. Prodigy, and uh, I mean everybody knows the the Product GMB. Product GMB. You know we saying? got Robin Ness. Robin you know Ness, she right. she lived on Terrace. She lived on the second floor. Man, people don't know, you know the history. We got a lot of talent coming out of Hempstead. You know just Long Island period. Eddie Murphy. You know. Right out of Roosevelt, right? You know in Roosevelt, Howard Stern came out of Roosevelt. Dr. You know, J came out of Roosevelt. Dr. J came out of Roosevelt. Aaron it's just Damian Hall from God came out of Roosevelt. You know, we just got a lot of bit, and you know, and Francis Martin came out of um, Strong Island, you know? So it's, it's it's just like the young generation holding the torch, man. And it's just a blessing to just be embraced with these brothers, man. All right, man, any uh, shout outs you want to give to anybody out there that, that helped uh, you get this far? Because, you know, I know people can't usually do things by themselves. You always have a team, of people behind you, even if it's just your, you know, your wife, your mom, your, your aunt, your uncle, somebody always helps somebody along. And they always get left out and don't get, and, and don't get the, you know, the, the proper respect and, and admiration and, and the recognition they deserve. So anybody you want to shout out, you know, that you might not be able to get to on the album? <laughs> I definitely, I definitely, first I want to say is no I in team. It's like LeBron, you can't just be that one player. So I definitely want to thank you, Johnny Juice, for working on this with me. And um, and I, I, first I want to just want to thank God, man, because it's like God has always been a blessing. I believe I should have been died like two or three times in my lifetime, but God has always protected me and he always, he always had his shield over me, you know, protecting me. And, um, I just want to thank all the producers that helped me work on this um, album here. The best is yet to be written. Bula, you know, Johnny Juice, um, half on the track. And um, my kids, my family, and um, my mother, my pops. You know, I love my mom to death. You know, she's a good inspiration in my life, you know. And, um, and, and that's about it, man. Everything is really family and orientated. There's too many snitches out there, too many conspiracies. So. My everything is like a close knit, you know, family orientated, you know, cause I can't afford no more conspiracies. As I said, you know, the ankle bracelet is here, you know, so I, I can't afford it, man. It's hurting me, you know. I gotta be home at eight o'clock. I'm missing out on a lot. Even though I got time to do great music with Johnny, I'm missing out on shows right now. I'm missing out on promoting the album right now. It's like I'm missing out a lot. Cause I gotta be in the house at eight o'clock on a curfew, man. So it's like, for all y'all kids out there, do the right thing, man. And, and, and watch who you be around, man. Cause this conspiracy is not a game, man. You ain't gotta do nothing. Just just knowing the wrong person, you'll get caught in the quagmire. And it, it's, it's really real out there, man. You know, just knowing the wrong person. You ain't gotta do nothing, man. You know? And there you have it, man. That's Francis Martin coming straight out of Hempstead, Strong Island, Terrace Ave. Terrace Ave, 100 so, uh, Block. 
you know, look for big things from uh, Francis more than 2011, all right? Uh, Johnny Juice, trying to keep a low key.